Hello everyone. Now I would like to talk about integration rules for exponential function. Let u is a differentiable function of x. Rule 1, the integral for e to the power x with respect to x here e to the power x like x, it will be e to the power x itself plus c. Rule 2, you have e to the power u with respect to u, it will be e to the power u itself plus c, and u like u. How to use these rules? Example 1, find Integral for e to the power 3x minus 2 with respect to x. Here, you can let u is equal to 3x minus 2. This means you can get du is equal to 3dx. And dx is what is third du by dividing by 3 in both sides. Now you can write the given here integral 4, e to the power 3x, it will be e to the power u, and dx, it will be third du. Now we have the rule, you can apply it, then integral for e to the power u du, it will be e to the power u itself, and third is a constant, then add c. Now you can replace u by its value, then it will be third e to the power 3x minus 2 plus c. Or if you look for here x, and here this is not x, okay, and if you're gonna apply this rule e to the power u du, then these values must be the same, 3x minus 2. Then here you can write what is the derivative for 3x minus 2 will be 3 okay then here you must divide by 3 here it will be there e to the power 3x minus 2 d 3x minus 2 the derivative for the differential for 3x minus 2 is 3 divide by 3 it will be 1 then now you will apply the rule third this is e to the power u du, e to the power x dx, the same. Then it would be the same function, 3x minus 2 plus c. I think the same answer. If you want to find the integral for this one, look for the derivative of 3x. It will be 3, then divide by 3, or divide by 3 here, 3 dx here and divide by 3 out and this function is or this value is the derivative for up then it will be the derivative for this one it will be there integral for e to the power 3x minus 2 and 3 dx mean d3x minus 2 then it is there e to the power 3x minus 2 plus c Example 2, if you have integral for e to the power 3x squared plus 1 multiplied by x dx or 5x dx here. If you look for 5x dx and look for the exponent here and put the exponent is equal to u, u is equal to 3x squared plus 1, this means du is equal to 6x plus dx and x dx is what is 1 over 6 du. If you replace everything here in the given, it will be integral for e to the power u and 5x dx it will be 5 over 6 du, then it will be 5 over 6 multiplied by integral for e to the power u du. We have the rule here. Be 5 over 6 e to the power u plus c and u is what 
u is 3x squared plus 1 plus c. Or, you can write the question like, 5 is out, integral for e to the power 3x squared plus 1, and you have x dx, and what's, what is the derivative for 3x squared? It will be 6x, that you multiply by 6 here, and divide by 6 out. Now we can rewrite the question as 5 over 6 multiplied by e to the power 3x squared plus 1, d 3x squared plus 1. What is the derivative for 3x squared plus 1? It will be 6x dx. Now, the exponent like this value. Then you can e to the power u du. Then this function is u, and this function is u. The same values here. Then it will be 5 over 6 e to the power u plus 1 plus c. I think the same answer. If you going to apply the rule directly without substituting. Example 3. Find the integral for e to the power x over find integral for e raised to power 1 over x divided by x squared with respect to x. Here you can put u is equal to 1 over x. This means du is equal to x squared. Apply the quotient rule or write u is equal to x to the power negative 1. This means du is negative 1x to the power negative 2 dx, which is mean du is equal negative 1 over x power 2 dx. Now we have 1 over x power 2 dx over x power 2. Then 1 over x power 2 dx is equal to negative du. Now take the given integral for e to the power u dx over x squared, like this one, it is negative du. Now apply the rule, it will be negative e to the power u plus c. And u is what? u is 1 over x. Then it will be negative e to the power 1 over x plus c. Another example. Number 4. Evaluate the definite integral from 0 to 1 for e to the power negative x with respect to x. Now here, this is negative x, not x. Okay, then let u is equal to negative x, this means du is negative dx, then dx is negative du. Now replace here, and here x equal to 0, this means u is equal to 0, and when x is equal to 1, this means u is negative 1. The integral from 0 to 1, it will be from 0 to negative 1. For what? For e to the power u. dx is negative du. Now you can replace e to the power u by this value. This is negative. e to the power u itself from 0 to negative 1, then it will be negative. e to the power negative 1 minus e to the power 0, this mean negative e to the power negative 1, 1 over e minus 1, and use your calculator to get 
the value here. Thank you for watching.